channel it's Muffy here and thank you for dropping back in my channel and don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell down below for more updates on my videos so for today's video I'm gonna be doing a simple everyday makeup so without further ado just keep on watching I already primed my face using the Maybelline pore eraser to hide a little bit of our pores Medyo marami tayong pores dito on this side because of the acne scars that I got a few years ago. So uh, for, for your information guys, I do have um, oily skin and well actually I learned makeup because of the, the acne, acne that I got a few years ago. So uh, um, let's get started. So first off, I'm going to be using this um, MAC. MAC Cream Concealer in the shade NW25. Actually, I, I already hit the pan here. So this is my um, this is my second uh, container, guys. I already consumed the other one. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, put it on my acne scars. So, kung meron kayong mga acne or kahit acne scars o, or di kaya mga block, uh, dark spots, so ilagay lang natin ilagay lang natin nito guys so just to cover it up. Superstay 24 hour foundation um, this is really matte guys and this is a really full coverage foundation this is by the way my holy grail foundation so I can use full coverage foundation um, for everyday so for on my face siguro, I usually pump um, two pumps I usually use two pumps for on my face so I'm using this um, flat uh, brush, foundation brush. Okay. So, pat 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 ko lang on all areas para may equally distributed yung foundation. So, I usually put concealer after my foundation. So, ito yung ginagamit ko yung Maybelline Instant Age Rewind ano, um, Concealer. Ito napaka ano, um, may benefits ito guys. Okay, ito na. Last na yung product. So, 
a little bit goes a long way guys so konti lang nga So, ito na yun guys, yung uh, tapos na yung concealer natin. So, we have to set it with a loose powder. Okay, I'm using this um, Kuti Airspun um, Kuti Airspun uh, Loose Face Powder. I'm in a shade of naturally neutral. So, I'm using this punch um, that I got from Watson's. So, um, i-dip na natin dito sa uh, pan oh, hindi pala ako nakakuha so ganito ako kumuha guys pat 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 ng konti tapos ito na yung product ganito lang ka konti yung kukunin natin so pat natin dito okay lagay natin sa uh, kung saan tayo naglagay ng concealer ito naman sa mata tapos dito sa ano basta lahat na nilagyan natin ng concealer we have to set it with the powder okay tapos na tayo for setting tapos na tayo mag-set guys. So, while setting our um, concealer, uh, gawin natin yung gawin natin yung kilay. So, that's basically the next step. For me ha, yun yung kasunod after the concealer. The product that I used in my eyebrows is the L'Oreal Brow Artist. Okay. This is the L'Oreal Brow Artist. So, ito yung first na gagamitin ko, yung angled. Oh, by the way, um, um, first off talaga, binabrush off ko yan, kilay ko, na konti lang. Um, kasi, di ba, naglagay tayo ng powder kanina, so, na setting powder, tsaka yung foundation. Medyo nakakover yung uh, kilay natin. So, brush off lang ng konti sa kilay. So, ito na gagamitin natin yung uh, it trace na natin yung kilay. susunod guys is i-tap off na natin yung uh, 
powder. Let's remove the excess powder that we placed kanina. Yung nagset tayo na concealer. So, spread lang para maano na yung iba. Ibang part. Malagyan ng powder. Okay. Okay, make sure hindi tayo nagmukhang panda, ha? So, So, ayun. Tapos na yung kilay. Punta na tayo sa mm, minsan inuuna ko yung eyeshadow. Minsan yung blush ko naman. Nagkukontrol tsaka yung blush. Pero ngayon um, eyeshadow muna tayo. Okay. Okay, by the way, I'm using this um, Jazzy. Alright. Jazzy Sleek Matte Eyeshadow Palette. Ito guys, napakagandang mga kulay nito. It's actually, um, um, it's all matte and the color payoff is really great. Napaka pigmented ng mga kulay nito. So like this one, ito yung plum. This is my most favorite color among all for, uh, maganda to for smoky eye look. So ito yun guys. Oh, di ba? Ang ganda <laughs> ng color payoff. So yun. Ito yung favorite ko. Meron din naman nito for everyday, like this one. Ito yung ginagamit ko for everyday. Tsaka, um, combination yan ng itong light na parang peachy shade, tapos itong brown na to. So, let's get this, um, peach, peachy shade. So, ito. Tap lang na konti. Konti lang, guys. Uh, to remove, uh, tap muna to remove the excess shadow para hindi naman masyadong nakakatakot yung shadow natin. So, first is nalalag nilalagay ko pala ito sa crease. Parang ito na rin yung transition color natin, guys. So, by the way, I'm using this Wet n Wild um, blending brush. So, ito, lalagay muna natin on the crease, but not actually concentrated below the crease, but um, on the crease and above. A little bit uh, higher on the crease, but Kasi ako medyo maliit yung mata ko. So, I need to widen up my eyes para uh, hindi pangit tingnan. So, ito again, um, the best, for best results for in blending your eyeshadow is that kahit ano yung brush na gagamitin natin, kahit ano pang brand yan, kay synthetic hair o yung talagang tuto, totoong hair, hindi magmamatter yan kasi Ang, ang, ang perfect blending is coming right from your hand talaga. Kung dito tayo humahawak sa end ng brush, mas lighter yung ano, kamay natin. Mas light lang yung paggawa ng stroke ng eyeshadow. And maimove mo ng maayos yung kamay mo. Para maimove ng mas wider yung yung range ng movement ng brush. Ayan. So. Ayan. So, after that, so, ito na yung peachy color na eyeshadow na gusto, gusto ko for an everyday. Kung gusto naman natin, gusto mong maglagay ng, ano, um, brown on the corner of your eye, Sige, gawin natin yan today. Um, kahit everyday, pwede naman. So, I'm using this more tapered uh, blending brush. Uh, let's use this color. Tap ko lang ng dalawa ha, tapos tap, tap, tap na yung brush for the excess powder. Ito. Lagay lang natin sa corner of our eyes and then working our brush going up and hindi na hindi na aabot sa gitna diyan lang because my goal here is going malaki yung eyes ko so hindi ko hindi hanggang dito yung dark na ano no my shadow so dito lang talaga sa crease um one fourth ng crease kumbaga so yan lang ayan lang yan lang yung ano natin so again kuha tayo ng kulay so tap tap Dito na naman sa kabila. 
same thing. One fourth lang ng crease na uh, ano natin, lalagyan natin ng brown. Tapos blend lang ng blend. Don't forget yung paghawak ng brush at that tip. Almost parang nasa dulo na halos ng brush. So, ayan. Yun. Okay na ba yan, guys? So, my next, um, so, ang next na kulay na ilalagay ko is dito sa, dito sa gitna ng eyelid. So, I'm using this, matagal na to, guys. I'm using this Wet n Wild palette, eyeshadow palette. This is a comfort zone palette from Wet n Wild. So, itong shade na to guys, ito lang yung gagamitin natin. Medyo, may shimmer siya ng konti lang. Yung shimmer lang na konti, hindi yung bonggang-bonggang shimmer. So, it, ito parang peachy din siya, mauve, peachy tsaka mauve, yung mix na ganun. So, usually, nag, uh, gumagamit tayo ng ganitong brush, flat shader brush. Pero ako, pag nagmamadali, gagamitin ko yung finger ko. Tapos, yung ring finger usually, ito yung ginagamit ko. And then, uh, make sure na nahugasan yung kamay nyo before doing your makeup. So, ito, kuha lang tayo ng product. Lagay natin sa gitna ng eyelid. Para ma-brighten naman yung eyes natin. Minsan, nilalagay ko yung lighter shade. Pero ngayon, gusto ko, feel ko lang yung ganito. Ito talaga yung basic everyday eye makeup ko. Yun lang. So, pagkatapos niyan, pag gusto ko naman mag eyeliner, especially yung mata ko is maliit, so I have to put eyeliner dito sa taas, pero hindi sa baba. <laughs> hindi sa baba guys, kasi pag nilagyan pa natin ng eyeliner, eyeliner na black niyan, nako, yung mata ko magiging sobrang liit-liit. Kaya, eh, hindi, hindi ko gusto mangyari yun. So, lagay lang tayo ng ito na, yung susunod na kabanata. Usually, naglalagay ako ng brown eyeliner dito sa baba. So, pagka walang brown eyeliner, nasa ano, skip na lang natin yan. And susunod is, um, to mag-curl tayo ng lashes. So, make sure nakatingin sa mirror Kasi masakit yan pag naipit. Masakit yung eyelid, guys. <laughs> yan yung struggle ko before. So, I mean, this time, I'm using this Maybelline Magnum Big Shot um, um, Mascara. So, ito pang everyday lang talaga na mascara. Uh, uh, tumutulong rin ito sa pag-lengthen. Tsaka, nagbibigay ng um, volume ng aking pilik mata. Ayan, guys. So, sa kabil. Oh, by the way, yung sa kababa. Sa ubus, guys. Sa ubus. Okay, ano? Sa ubus. 
Tapos curl na naman tayo sa kabila. Ouch! Ayan na, sinasabi ko. Kasi, hindi tumingin sa salamin. Lagay lang tayo na mascara. Bakit kaya pag naglalagay tayo ng mascara, nakanganga? Pwede bang gano, ganito? Mahirap. <laughs> Dalagang nakanganga. Okay. Tapos sa ubos na naman, guys. Alam niyo yung sa ubos? Down below. <laughs> Ang liit talaga ng pilik mata ko sa baba, guys. Tingnan nyo. Halos wala. Okay, so tapos na tayo sa mata. Next is we are going to bronze our face. So, ganito. Ito na rin yung ginagamit kong contour, guys. Eh, maganda yung kulay pang contour. Kaya ito. I'm using this Physician Formula Butter Bronzer in a shade Sunkissed. So, I'm using this um, angled brush. Mas dense siya na angled brush from Marino Diatarian. I got this from Watts, Watsons. Ito yung gustong gusto ko for contour kasi nga. Na e, ayan, tingnan nyo. Ganito. Since malaki yung mukha ko, I, talagang I need to contour my face para naman maging sexy. O, tingnan nyo. Tingnan nyo yung difference, guys. Ito, meron contour. Ito naman, wala. Kaya, kung mahilig, kung hindi kayo mahilig mag-diet, mag-contour na lang tayo, guys, para maging slim yung mukha natin. So, contour lang. Huwag masyadong ano, ganahan sa pag-contour. Baka mukha tayong, ano nito, muddy yung contour natin. And, tingnan nyo, guys may contour na yung face ko. Lumiit yung gan dito sa kabila. So, ito na naman. Sa kabila. On the left side, contour natin para lumiit din. Kahit pa paano. Dito pala ako nagkukontour, guys. So, on the upper part of my ear, tapos, hindi talaga aabot dito sa left corner ng lips. Dito lang. Tapos, gan ganun din sa kabila. And, so, oh, di pa. Di pa. Kulang pa pala. Blend pala ng maayos yung contour, guys, para hindi masyadong obvious. Okay. Oh, parang may lumampas. Okay, so next I'm using this um, fluffier um, blending, no, fluffier angled brush. Ito mas makapal siya kaysa kanina. And again, dap tayo ng konti. Pat, pat. Pat, pat, pat. Dito natin ilagay on our, oh, hairline. Dito lang sa hairline. Sa akin, hindi lang sa hairline. <laughs> Kasi malaki yung noo ko. So, dito na. Dito ko ilalagay. Okay. Make sure pantay yung pagkalagay ng ano. Sabi nga nila, yung, um, ano, yung pag-contour ay yung rule of three, guys. So, from here, dito, sa pa baba. Parang number three. And, syempre, don't forget our chin on our jawline. Para ma-hide yung mga double chin natin. Okay, dito lang sa jawline. Okay. 
So, tapos na tayo sa contour. Next is the blush. So, I'm going to use this um, smaller angled brush. Um, this time, I'm using this Wet n Wild Color Icon um, Palette in a shade of Mellow White. So, wala tayo. Ito, konti, konti lang guys. Kasi, pigmented itong bagay lang tayo ng konti. Dito, sa Apple and our Cheeks. And, kung gusto niyo yung drunk blush, dalhin hanggang dito yung blush. Tapos, sa kabila naman. Hmm. Hmm. Napasubrahan guys. Oh my gosh. Sumabra yata yung So, technique lang guys. Pag medyo napasobra kayo ng, ng blush, ano, kunin lang natin yung brush na ginamit natin sa foundation. So, yun. Pat, pat, pat lang konti para hindi magiging obvious. Next, um, I'm using, um, we're gonna put some colors on my lips. I'm using this uh, Happy Skin. This is a Shut Up and Kiss Me. So, ito maganda for everyday also. Parang mauvey na ano siya. So, this is it. Ito na yung um, everyday makeup ko. Um, I hope you learned something from my video today. And, um, kung meron kayong mga tanong, please don't, call, don't forget to leave your comment down below for any suggestions. So, um, that's all for today, guys. Thanks for watching. See you on my next video. Bye!